Oh. <laughs> I'm looking, I'm looking out the window. I press start and then I start looking out the window. Da, 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 da. Good morning, good morning. So let me start again. Hi guys, Dr. Wendy Dearborn here from the Laws of Attraction in Action. Good morning, good morning, good morning, guys. Well, I hope you're having a wonderful Saturday morning. It's a beautiful Saturday morning here in Las Vegas. A little crisp. I can't say that it's cold because it's not. At the end of the day, it's not. Um, but it's a little cool this morning, a little crisp. It's a beautiful morning here. And as always, I'm always talking about being grateful and I am grateful, grateful for my life and the choices that I've made in my life. So that being said, guys, real quick, what I wanted to say to you before I started my day, as it were, is what three things do you want for yourself in 2018? We're approximately 22, 21, 22 days away from the 1st of January 2018. And another year has gone by. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping, and I'm believing that all the things that you wanted for 2017 have manifested for you. And if they didn't manifest in their entirety, it's my hope that they manifested in such a way that they've set up the um, foundation for you to move forward in a way that works well for you. One of the things that I want to say about that is that there is a um, the divine flow or a divine order. And we spoke about this. I think that we spoke about this this year in the show. Um, the, uh, my Life, My Choice, our podcast, weekly podcast, we spoke about the divine order of things and there is a divine order of things you know if you if you want to fly i'll phrase it this way basically you need wings and sometimes those wings have to sprout and grow and then you have to practice and and know what to do and how to flutter them and how to move how to you know how to find that current that you can sail in the whole nine yards and so perhaps this year if you haven't actually um, manifested everything that you wanted instead of looking at it as a, a dud or it didn't work perhaps just perhaps you were actually establishing your foundation and we all need a foundation to work on so that being said actually I put the heater on in here and it is a little warm that being said what is it that you are wanting? Three things that you are wanting for 2018. What three things are you wanting for yourself? It's time to really start thinking about them. It's time to start having a conversation with self. And not in regard to what you don't have, what you didn't accomplish, what you don't, you know, what you need, what you don't think that you, you can achieve. It's time to start having that conversation about what it is that you can achieve for self. So guys, give it a thought. So I'm asking you to ask yourself this question, the golden question. You know the question. What is it that I am wanting for myself in 2018? What, what is it that I'm wanting for me? And then, of course, what it looks like. What does that look like? You know, what does that look like? the thing that you say that you want what does it feel like what does it sound like what does it taste like what does it smell like marrying your five senses to it will allow you to truthfully embrace it and believe it not only at a conscious level but at a subconscious level and that's where that's where the beauty of um, manifestation takes place at the subconscious level so once again, give yourself, give it some thought and write it down, write it down, write it down, write it down, look at it, read it. Does it feel right? Are you really want, are you saying you're wanting these things because you're actually wanting them for you? Or are you saying that you're wanting these things because you think that's what you should do? Write it down. So that's what I wanted to share with you on this beautiful Saturday morning. So until next time, guys, um, again. Ask yourself the question, have that dialogue, start that dialogue with self, start that dialogue with you, because only you can answer this question, only you know you. And let, let me just say this, 
if it is wealth you're looking for, if it's health you're looking for, if it's what, whatever it is that you're looking for, don't say that you want this and marry yourself, you know, marry your five senses to it, etc, etc. And then turn around and say something like, oh, you know, I want to have enough money to be comfortable, whatever that means to you. And then two minutes later, you're saying, God, I'm never going to have enough money that I'm going to be comfortable. The thing that you truly believe is the thing that you'll manifest. So don't negate your words. It's important to actually um, be very conscious of the words that are coming out of your mouth. But that being said, I'm Dr. Wendy Dearborn. Of course, you're here on the um, group page. And you can find me also at the laws of attraction in action.com. And be sure to check out our podcast. And that's my co host, Olivia Lashley, and myself on Wednesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Blog Talk Radio. And you can also find the reruns right here on iTunes and um, the website. So on that note, guys, have a wonderful Saturday. I intend to. Until next time, peace.